We're here at the English Premier Yearling Sale with David as a party from Dream Thoroughbreds. Uh, we purchased a lovely raising bow filly. Can you tell us a bit about what you saw, what you liked about the horse? Yeah, so it's the um, Lot 176. Raisin Bow filly out of an exceeding cell mare, which is the same cross as to sort, they're God's sort of favourite at the moment. Um, we loved it the first time we saw her, uh, great temperament, very athletic, good bodied horse, a filly that we think will run as a two year old, um, pretty, an early running two year old. And uh, we saw her three times, and every time we saw her, same sort of temperament, impressed us every time. So when you see them sort of three or four times, you fall in love with them and then you've got to get them for the right price and we did so we're very happy with the price and plenty of shares available in it we've had a few taken up pretty quickly um she's going to be trained by kieran maher and david eustace at caulfield uh who are obviously very popular we're going to be one of the leading um training uh, partnerships in melbourne um and uh with brazen bow i think he's averaging nearly two hundred thousand. we bought this filly for 150 so the shares will be very very um good value for what his average is and um, yeah, so he'll, he'll, she'll go on the market in, this week with the final pricing, getting insurance and a few things that sorted out. But uh, yeah, lovely filly, very excited to have her. Yeah, so we bought a written tycoon colt um, from Classic Sale in, in Sydney. Uh, he was the third highest lot. Um, really, really athletic uh, colt, very impressive. Uh, stallion type of colt, um, if you can win a, a group race. Um, just like I am Immortal, who won the uh, the preview and the prelude recently, we think he's the type of colt who could be at the Blue Diamond next year. Um, he's gone to Anthony Friedman um, at Flemington, and uh, yeah, pretty excited about him too. So we've got a real, real nice lot of um, yearlings this year. Horses that we think will be running as two-year-olds and then improving into their three-year-old year. I'm Immortal, how did he come through the Blue Diamond? Yeah, he pulled up great. Yeah, he's he pulled, come out of the race really good. Um, Really, uh, he's gone back to Pinecliff now. He's had a bit of a week there. Um, he's jumping out of his skin, but we're going to put him out for the spring now. So we'll give him a two-month break out at uh, St Ives, where Anthony uh, Friedman lives, and he can monitor him. And then he'll come back for the uh, the short course sort of sprints for the three-year-olds, and hopefully get him to the Coolmore on Derby Day, which is a, probably a, a stallion-making race. I think he's. He'll probably find himself as a stallion at some stage because he's the only um, stakes winning I'm Invincible Colt this season. So, uh, especially a two year old stakes winner for I'm Invincible. So, uh, yeah, if he can pull off a nice one in the spring, he's got, a, he's got a nice future ahead of him. Can you give us a lead to any other horses that you've got to look out for? Yeah, so we've got, um, well, we had Mr. Sneaky. Unfortunately, he's out for the autumn. He, um, we had to get a chip removed out of his knee, but he's actually, he'll recover out of that operation really good. So, he's coming back for another spring campaign, uh, obviously targeted probably towards that River Clark again, which he ran second in to Santa Ana Lane a couple of years ago. Um, and we've got another couple of yearlings we bought, uh, a Snitzel filly and a Zusar filly. So we're, we're trying to buy commercial stallions. Uh, horses, as I said, will be up and running as two-year-olds. And uh, out of, you know, um, good related families, the Snitzel filly's out of a fast net rock uh, mare. Um, and the Zoo Star. Zoo Star is actually in our uh, all female syndicate, so that's actually nearly full. But um, she's a nice little running filly, um, and it's good to get for the females. Always fine with the female syndicates to get one that's up and running early for them, so they can get to the races and enjoy the champagne as early as possible. And what's the best way that people can get in contact with you? Yeah, so we've got the the website dreamthoroughbreds.com.au. Um, that's got all of our horses for sale and for syndication available. It's also got the list of all of our horses and, and where they're at at the moment, a bit of news about what events are coming up. And if you want to, you can call me on 0416 105 666. Beautiful. All the best for the rest of the season and especially in the spring. Thanks, Stacey.